Hi guys, how you doing? Welcome to Crumbs to Gourmet. You're with me, Joel. I'm gonna do a healthy recipe for you, a healthy vegetarian recipe. I know there are not many vegetarian recipes that you know you can just stir up with basic ingredients. Yes, we're gonna do a gourmet snack today. You wanna know more? Stay tuned. Well, today's vegetarian snack is a stuffed zucchini. Yes, I know many of you love zucchinis out there, which is why I decided to come up with this dish. So, the champion of this dish today is zucchini. Come on, let me show you the ingredients. Two garlic cloves, one carrot, grated, 30 grams of paneer, which I've diced, one tablespoon of olive oil, one tablespoon of tomato puree, one tomato which I have sliced, one onion which is diced, a handful of parsley, a tablespoon of black pepper powder, salt to taste and a whole zucchini. The dish we named stuff zucchini could be many things. Now I'll take a zucchini for example. How do you stuff a zucchini? Well, let me show you. It's very simple. What you're going to do is cut it into half. So you will have four parts of the zucchini. The flesh is there, you will scoop it out with a spoon like this, you just scoop it up with a spoon and discard the flesh or use it into making the dish further. So come on, let me show you how to stuff the zucchini. Cut off the top and the bottom of the zucchini. There's nothing to it, it's just inedible. That's about it. You want to make an exact half. Here you go. And cut it into half again. You cut the zucchini into one half and then again you cut them into another half from lengthwise. So this is how you do it. So you have four pieces of zucchini. Now you have to scoop the flesh because you have to stuff it with the vegetable mix. So it's a very simple thing. You just want to take scoop out the seeds. So you just guide your and you just scoop it out. There's no pressure, it is very simple. And you have scooped out the zucchini. Okay, so we have done removing out the flesh from the zucchini. And we have got all the flesh with us ready. All you have to do is get everything together, put it into the blender, get it nice and pureed, and we are done. Second, we will put in our carrots and the garlic. Then we'll put in our tomato puree. After that, we'll put in our onions. The handful of parsley, a tablespoon of black pepper, salt, and then let's go ahead and puree the mixture. We want our consistency to be a little bit more chunkier than usual, so do not puree it. You want it to look nice, you want a little mouthfeel when you're eating those stuff, Korge. Yeah, that's about it. Our puree mixture is done. It's nice and coarse and chunky, just the way we want it to be. So come on, I'll show you how we go ahead and make one of the zucchinis. Just a little salt. Seasoning is very important. I'll put a little bit of olive oil. So as I said, healthy. As you see till now, there's nothing added. Just a little bit of olive oil. I love the taste of olive and zucchinis. It goes very well with each other. Now, the stuffing and make and I just like to let you know that the parsley has really made this the aromas come out of this mixture. And the sweet carrots and obviously the juicy onions. Everything goes so well with each other. It's like a complete dish that complements one another. Okay, so that's done. After which I don't have a spoon, so I'll just use my fingers, excuse me. Uh, I'll just put a little bit of the paneer on top of it. Look how beautiful this dish is coming together. Aye, a pure vegetarian delight. There we go. So, you see. So that's how our stuffed zucchini looks. It looks crazy. The aromas are mind-blowing. You can substitute paneer with maybe soya if you're vegan, or you can do it with chicken, or pepperoni, or anything that you prefer as a topping. Or maybe you just put nothing at all. Let's go ahead and put it in the oven right now. This is how a zucchini looks after 15 minutes at being in the oven for 180 degrees Celsius. Now, what I'm going to do next is make four quarters 
of each tomato slice and just apply three of them on the zucchini. Voila! I'll just take a little salt just to season. There we go. And now send this to the oven for another 10 minutes at 180 degrees Celsius and we have our snack ready. Our stuffed zucchini hot right out of the oven. If you want to know more recipes like this, subscribe to India Food Network. If you enjoyed watching this recipe or you have any views or comments, send in your views and I'll answer your queries. Till then, happy eating.